Discrimination is a key skill for any learner using a picture-based communication system, whether it is low or high tech. This central component is not always readily acquired by learners and often leads to teachers to feel frustrated. Even after attending a PECS basic training, some teachers find their students continue to have difficulty with picture discrimination. This app allows teachers to try several effective strategies to help improve a learner's discrimination performance. The PECS Phase 3 app is designed to help teach simple and conditional picture discrimination. It is not designed to be used as a standalone communication device. This app should only be used when a potential user has acquired Phase 1 and 2 via traditional PECS use. Furthermore, while this app is used to teach discrimination in ways that are similar to those used in Phase 3, the user should have continuous access to his or her own PEX communication book. Let's start the app to explore its features. As you can see, the welcome screen provides you with the steps to use the app. The app looks just like a PEX book. It has six tabbed pages in six different colors. To modify the settings on each page, select the setting icon, and you can change the number of Velcro brand strips from 0 to 7 and the color of each page. The number of pictures per page depends on the size pictures you are using. The General Settings menu allows you to choose various audio settings, such as gender, whether or not to align pictures to the Velcro strips, and if you want a reminder of the number of pictures on each tab. To prevent your student from accidentally accessing the settings and options, Change your unlock setting under the Sessions option to either a double or triple tap. The app allows you to create books for multiple students so that you can customize each book depending on your learner's specific needs. The first step to customizing a book is selecting the appropriate images from the picture library. You can choose from our set of 150 Pix for Pex images organized by categories, or you can select from your personal library. Once you locate the picture you need, Simply drag it onto the PECS page. Tap the Hide button to close the picture menu. Next, choose the properties for each image. To change the size of all the images on the page, select the Size Slide bar to the size you want, then select Apply to All, and all of the pictures will be the same size. Under the Display menu, you can choose whether to display the image and the printed word, the image only, or just the word. The feedback option allows you to set the transparency level of each image. For this demonstration, we will start with a Phase 3A simple discrimination and use pictures of a preferred and a non-preferred or non-reinforcing item. In the lower left-hand corner of each picture, you can designate the picture as that of a preferred item by selecting the plus or non-preferred by selecting the minus. Any picture taken from the Distractor tab will be automatically set to minus to indicate that it is the non-preferred item. Once you have set up your lesson, tap the lock icon. Choose the type of feedback your student will receive for each picture touch. Tap Start Selected Session and the PECS page is ready to go. If the student taps the target picture, the app celebrates and you can quickly deliver the preferred item. If your student touches the distractor icon, the app will give no feedback, at which point you should perform the four-step error correction. The app even provides you with a quick reminder for conducting the procedure. If your student is in Phase 3B of PEX, where he is learning to choose between equally desired items, make sure both pictures are set with a plus before beginning your lesson. Remember in Phase 3B to conduct periodic correspondence checks. The information menu also contains a reminder for how to do this. You can easily turn the vocal feedback off during a correspondence check and it turn it back on when the correspondence check is completed. To use the PECS Phase 3 app across the day, you can put pictures relevant to a particular activity on different tabs within your student's book. This fantastic app comes loaded with 150 Pix for PECS images, male and female voices that include on-off options, and a customizable library that can be created with an individual's own pictures. To purchase the PECS Phase 3 app, visit the Apple iTunes App Store and search for PECS Phase 3. If you are interested in finding out more about other apps created by Pyramid Educational Consultants, visit www.pex.com today.